What's up? So I apologize for the mess behind me. Uh, we're getting ready for a yard sale this weekend. So um, having been digging around um, some of our stuff, like books and movies and CDs and whatnot, I, I wanted to share <clears throat> some of my Batman um, graphic novels. Now these aren't all that I own, but these are ones that I got while I was deployed or when I was in Germany. Um, the others, of course, are still in storage back home. So the first one I wanted to share was Batman Haunted Night. And this is just um, a collection of three different uh, one-shots. Um, starting with Fear, uh, which fe features Batman going up against Scarecrow, so you can imagine what that's all about. You know, Scarecrow using his fear toxin to uh, to to mess with Batman's mind. Uh, the next one is Madness, which features a story where the Mad Hatter, as you can see on the cover here, uh, right there, uh, kidnaps Barbara Gordon and a whole bunch of uh, craziness ensues. <laughs> and then the last story is A Christmas Carol, which is a, a Batman uh, version of The Christmas Carol. So a lot of characters were replaced with characters from Batman. So if you can imagine that. it's I recommend this book. It's by um, Jeff Loeb, which of course if you've read um, The Long Halloween and Dark Victory, of course Long Halloween, um, some of The Dark Knight was based on that book. So it's I recommend it. It's one of the best ones ever. Um, next is Batman Arkham Asylum, A Serious House on Serious Earth. This is just incredible, this book. I mean, the artwork is, is truly one of a kind. I mean, you, you'll never see another Batman title drawn like this. I mean, just... So, of course, uh, as you can probably tell from the cover, um, a lot of crazy stuff going down in Arkham Asylum. Batman's called in to, uh, to square it away, and just craziness ensues. Um, some of the elements in this book are taken into the, the uh, latest Batman game, um, Arkham City, which came out a couple years ago. Then, of course, one of my favorites, um, I read this a few times while I was deployed, so Hush. Um, this is incredible. This this story, I believe, came out around 2002, 2003, um, which featured the new Batman villain. Um, if you have not read this, you need to go read it, if you're a Batman fan at all. If, you, if, if you're kind of sitting there wondering, man, I... I, w I want to get a graphic novel, but I'm not sure. Um, this is this is the one. It is incredible. A lot of uh, story twists and turns and, and revelations and, and just almost pretty much every villain in the Batman uh, universe is in this uh, story. And uh, it wouldn't be a Batman... Uh, story, graphic novel, anything, if this guy wasn't involved. So I got this for Christmas. Um, my wife got it for me. I, I've yet to read all the way through it, but from what I've read, I mean, this is the perfect book for me. This is, he's my favorite, probably my favorite character, definitely my favorite villain. Uh, of course, this is a famous scene from uh, The Killing Joke. You know, when he's telling his origin story, of course he's telling his origin story the way he wants to remember it. So, I mean, this just shows, you know, the history. So, of course, the death in the family um, shows a lot of from the classic uh, cartoon from the early 90s. I, I still, to this day, love that cartoon. Um, just all kinds of uh, different stories it tells. It even talks about, you know, when he has TV show incarnation and then the different um, movie incarnations of him. So from uh, Nicholson to, uh, to Heath Ledger. And this is 
probably my favorite. I love this painting right here. I, I just, I would love to have that framed and just hung up in my house. I, I can't get enough of it. So, um, yeah, I mean, if you guys, there's just another, like, I don't know, this is like almost like an encyclopedia. So definitely recommend that. So, um, everybody, uh, again, I have more at home. And once I'm able to finally just consolidate everything that I have, um, ugh, I will definitely um, be showing off some of my other uh, graphic novels. I have a lot of Marvel, X-Men type graphic novels. Um, so anyway, everybody take it easy. Tune in to tomorrow's Friday Night Cards. And hopefully, I, I hope I'll have some beer. I don't know. I, I, I'm still out of beer. I haven't gotten any. So maybe some will be coming my way tomorrow. Uh, you got to tune in to see. All right, everybody. Take it easy.